which minute, which second. But only thing is, this ticket is invisible. It's written here for everybody. However much you may love your wife, she will not come with you. However much you may love your children, they will not come with you. Nobody will come with you. Then the question arises, what will come with me? Only your good and bad deeds. Whatever you do in this earth, it will come. And because based on your good and bad deeds, you will take the next one. God is your only friend. Therefore, it is very necessary for us to cultivate good feelings, good thoughts, good intentions, good views in life. You should fill your heart with love and compassion. If you don't do that, you cannot change the world. You know why? Because when you cannot change your own self, how can you change the world? You are not able to change yourself. You have got a bad habit of smoking. You cannot stop smoking. And you want to change this world? Ridiculous. You have no control on your own self, brother. Only when you have control over yourself and take the right path, can you change this world. Only if you are a magnet, then you can attract everybody. If a magnet is covered with dust, Will it attract iron? But it is not the mistake of the magnet. The magnet is thinking, I have lost all my power of attraction. No! It is when the magnet thinks, Oh my God! I am not a magnet. At that time, great teachers come. Great teachers! Like Buddha, Jesus, Mahavir, Guru Nanak, Sai Baba, all these prophets, Muhammad, all these prophets and people come to tell you, my child, you are a magnet, do you know? No, I am not a magnet. Yes, my child, you have covered yourself with all negativity. Remove this negativity, throw them, clean them and you will shine like a magnet and the whole universe will get attracted towards you. What is required? Cleaning. Cleaning of what? No, every day sir I take bath. No, it is not that bath of cleaning. It is cleaning your internal negativity. You have to remove this internal negativity and put only positivity. When you put positivity, like good thoughts, good feelings, good intentions, feelings like love, compassion, helping others, patience, forbearance, when you have such qualities, all the negativity will start. What is negativity? Negativity is nothing but darkness. There was a man. He was told there is some, there is a monster inside a cave. There was a cave. The man was told there is a monster, demon, inside that cave. The name of that monster is darkness. You have to go and kill it. The man took a knife 
went inside and started doing like this, like this. He saw no monster. The darkness was still there. He came out. He said, but it is still there. He said, the other man said, no, no, you have to go and kill it. You have to remove this darkness, kill it. So he took a gun and went on shooting. But nothing happened to the darkness. The darkness was still there. He tried everything. Then a prophet came. A teacher came and said, My son, what are you doing? I am trying to kill the darkness. Then he said, How stupid you are. Take a lamp inside that cave. He took that lamp inside that cave and darkness vanished. So what is darkness? What is light? Absence of light is darkness. Absence of darkness is light. Means absence of negativity is positivity. Absence of positivity is negativity. That's all. You cannot go and buy positivity in there. It is already inside you. Only thing is, you have to understand where it is and try to bring them out in your life. That strength is inside you, the power is inside you. You cannot go and see. See, I went into cosmos, there is no God there. God is not sitting there on a throne like this. God is everywhere. It is inside you, it is inside plants, it is inside trees, it is inside animals, it is inside insects, it is everywhere. So these are the ideas that we are trying to teach children in India. We want them to spread this love everywhere. That we are one. We are one, there is no difference between us. We may be rich, we may be poor. We may be tall, we may be short. We may be thin, we may be fat. We may be white, we may be black. We may be intelligent, we may be stupid. We may be rich, we may be poor. It doesn't matter. We are still one. 